Peace and everyone, welcome to the Dragon's Number stream. Today we are playing Final Fantasy XV. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, it is the demo. Like, it's, I know it's subtle, you can kind of see it a little bit in the middle right there. There's, there's kind of this demo thing. Uh, yes, it is the demo for Final Fantasy XV. Uh, I hear that it's about four hours long, and uh, I've never played the game. I've never played XV. A uh, huge fan of Final Fantasy though, uh, loved the SNES games, I love, I loved a lot of them, I didn't like all of them, but I, I loved the SNES games, uh, I loved 10, uh, 9 was great, um, and it even prompted me to make my own JRPG, Our Light Core, uh, so yeah, very influential series, and I've been looking forward to trying out Final Fantasy XV for a long time. It's now just coming on PC, so let's dive into the universe um, for Final Fantasy XV. And I'm going to start off with a, a very small criticism. Um, you cannot navigate the, the menus with the uh, the thumbstick. I don't know why. Uh, it's 2018. Get with the program. There's no reason to prevent that. Like, no. Why? Why would you not allow that kind of stuff. Uh, it's it's very bizarre. Apparently it reloads the uh, the main menu when you back out of options. Uh, because why not? New game! Demo save data cannot be transferred to the full version. Okay. Um, easy. Uh, normal. Tutorial... Yeah, sure. Tutorial. You know, I'm always complaining about, oh, this is badly explained. We're going to do the tutorial. We're going to make sure that uh, it works fine. What a weird position to put the loading. I wonder if it was my cursor. So good to see you again. You remember my name, right? You gave it to me after all. Back to R. This is the old training room in the world of your dreams. I'm gonna teach you the ins and outs of this world to help you along your journey. I'm not skipping, by the way. This is skipping. This is moving to the next thing automatically. I don't know why. There's no voice acting, so... I don't know why they didn't put a button to, to choose this. Combat tutorials! GLaDOS so, uh, says he'll help you train. What a pal! Alright, let's get started. Defend yourself! Sound seems a little loud. There we go. Phase. Hold X to automatically evade attacks. Alright. Tap X to, uh, to dodge, or hold X, I guess, to be constipated. That's the way. My turn to strike. Uh, blitz. Hold B to automatically chain attacks. Move L while attacking to change the way the combo unfolds. Okay. Yeah. Maracas. Circle behind and whack. That's how you do it. So the, the real the real important question of this is is the music good? So far so good. Carrying. Wasn't I already carrying? Block and counter. Wait, block with axe? Oh I see what you mean. Okay. What? Wait. Quiet. 
Okay, so there's a lot of leniency here. I'm trying to get a feel- oh, I can jump. I'm trying to get a feel of when I'm supposed to press the button. Because I I pressed it when the prompt appeared, and uh, no, that was too, too early. Noctis will take heavy damage if you fail to perform the initial block. Okay, stay on guard and be ready to go. The intensive drill is available to hone you, to help you hone. I could not carry that because the game didn't want me to. Time to put all of them to put the two buttons that you learn into practice. Okay, um, kind of like this. No, it's not mash. It is not mash. It is hold. While you're holding the button, it continues to attack. Because, uh, basically, basically it's kind of an evolution of Final Fantasy XIII in a way. Where Final Fantasy XIII puts you into different states. You're into the attacking state, the healing state, all of that. This one does the same thing. Um with attacking state, uh, parry, there's a little bit of timing. It's not bad. Uh, okay, we'll see. I'm, I'm optimistic. I like this. Warping. It's warping time! Tyrannosaurus! Okay. Perform a blade warp. Okay. Hold and then press Y. Um... Point war. Okay. Oh, I like that. Okay. <laughs> Use your environment to do stuff. Um. I like the idea. If this uses MP, I'm gonna. I'm going to assume that MP. Um, oh, use items to replenish it? Wait, really? Oh, no! Cover? <laughs> you can't see me. I'm covered. There is cover in a Final Fantasy 15 game. Well, in a Final Fantasy game. Performing a point warp restores MP, okay? Warp strikes alone. So as long as I'm here... Okay, so MP does build gradually. I need to press B more. I need to press X. So, this is interesting because I feel like these. These um, these moves are kind of made to deal with a lot of enemies at once. And right 
like, okay, obviously this is a tutorial, there's only one enemy, but, um, I don't remember seeing a lot of enemies in the screenshots that I've seen. Oops. Ew. Oh, I can change weapons. Um, damage value may appear in different colors. Orange is increased. Purple is reduced. A javelin! Okay. Main menu gear. There's large enemies as well. Uh, okay, you'll be finding lots of enemies. Okay, that's fine. Uh, it, I guess I didn't, like, when I'm seeing uh, lots of enemies, I'm saying like 10 to 12 at the same time. And I don't feel like that. I saw all of that. But, I mean... I don't know a lot about this game, so it's fine. Uh, Javelin! I'm so glad that I did the tutorial. I kind of, I kind of had had a fair mind to go. Well, I'm just gonna wing it. No, I did it. Yeah, do the tutorial. Okay, gear, Noctis, daggers. Who wants daggers? Fire. Now I have five times five, so does that mean that I only get to cast it five times? Doesn't say. Uh. Boom! Oh, it does. Okay, T fire is time four. Okay. So it's it's Final Fantasy VIII all over again. Absorb. There you go. Oh, final shadow of the Arkham Colossus, a Silent Fantasy. Yeah. Enemies can be resistant. Blah blah blah. Uh, pause option combat. Yay, I got ice. Thank you. All right, let me let me do some stuff. Uh, elementy. Ooh. Crap spells using the okay. Fire. Ice. I can Okay, I can craft some blizzards. With a lot more power, I guess. Wait, what do I have? Oh, I see. So I got some some raw ice, and now I need to craft those into into spells. And my fire is a potency of ten. Wow. Okay. Huh. 
well, why not? How do I... How do I... Yes. Yes, that is what I want. Okay. What? Okay, so this this UI has a massive critical flaw right now. I don't know... Okay, where am I? I'm in Elemancy, which has followed me with Equip, which has followed me... Now, now, here I'm in Equip, but if I press A, it opens up this menu, and then I can kind of press... I can press B to go back, but it's not on the details at the bottom. So this menu really, what this menu really needs is kind of a, a breadcrumb. Tell me I went from this to this to this to this, because it is super confusing. Now I'm in party, but I, I didn't choose party early. Like if I, if I do equip, it goes directly to equip. But if I do back, it brings me to party, which... Ugh. So no, this... The, this should have had a bread, a list of breadcrumbs da, 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 to know where you are at all times because this is confusing. Um, and also, if I if I want to craft, there is no craft button. There is an assign button like this, and then that's it. I mean, there's no there's no confirm. There's no thank you. An energy and. An empty magic flask. I put, oh, the, the type of catalyst determines the spell's effect. Spell possesses four properties. Yeah. How do I? Why can't I create this? Like, what am I missing here? A doesn't work. None of the but. Like, is it because it's a tutorial and they're just blocking me from doing stuff? Maybe, it, maybe that's it. I mean, if it is, they, they, that's a terrible idea. They just told me to use this. Why would they give me ice if they don't want me to use ice? But there's no craft button. Like, I'm in here, I select this, and then I do this. Oh! The A button doesn't do anything! Why not just press A? What? Like, that does not look like a button. That looks like it's a title for the menu that's under it. Why would- why not just press A? Just press A! A! You know what? It's fine. There- there's- just press A and it'll probably ask me, do you really want to do the thing? Like... Okay. Blizzard. Boom! Okay, there you go. Yeah, I mean, it's... it's. I don't know why. Like, I, I should not have been as confused as I am. I don't feel like... Because everything kind of blends together. It's all very blue. Um... Pressing A is a pretty basic thing. 12, 12 pages long complaint article about the UI. Yeah, I mean, it, 
Whoa, it's that guy! It's Prompto! If they are nearby when Noctis performs a parry or blindside, they may join in. Okay. Let's do this. Okay. Press B when prompted. Uh, spend AP in the ascension menu to learn more stuff. There's a lot of stuff. There. So, I kind of wish I was learning this. First of all, not in a, in a box room, but throughout the adventure. Oh, remember that thing? Yeah, we're gonna learn that thing. And we're gonna move through all of these rooms and... I don't know, it's not always going to look the same. Um, what? What just happened? Was I supposed to parry? Thank you! I figured I'd cover, because why not? There we go. They do not automatically recover, need to be rescued first. Rescue Prompto. Didn't I just do that? I did. I pressed, I pressed the button immediately. Still, uh, while in danger. I mean, no one wants to use an elixir. If you've played a Final Fantasy game, uh, Final Fantasy game in the past, okay, like this, this is dumb. If I'm in here, oh, I was gonna say that I can, I can move, but no, it's paused. So the the menu is paused right right now, so I can't move. No one is attacking me. Maybe in the real game, it's actually going to be active. But like, again, why force me to use the D-pad instead of of putting the uh, the um, joystick? Like, it's I I don't understand at all. Okay. Are there? Cr I mean, no. It was the default thing. Maybe, maybe it is an option. If it is, like, there's no reason because the D pad, the uh, the uh, joystick literally does nothing. So I don't understand why that would be an option. Really? Are you okay? I mean, why would that be an option? There's no reason to make that an option. It's like, oh, do you want it to do nothing or something? Okay, none of those are what I'm looking for. Yeah, no. This, that is not what I'm looking for. What I'm looking for is the ability to navigate these menus with uh, the joystick. Which is not a thing, apparently. Yep. Are you telling me that there's more than one place? Well, these are all on the on the keyboard and mouse. They're not on the the the, the uh, joystick. Yeah, this is this this is all keyboard and mouse. It's not. Uh, <laughs> and this is the. Oh, it's weird, right? Uh, key, controls. Well, controls is actually the controller, and keybinds is for the keyboard. Yeah.
I, I think it's just not there. Like, there's no reason. Is you know, millions of dollars. Can't figure out that a joystick it should be able to navigate a menu. Is yeah. All right. Okay, so it, the thing appeared, oh, okay. So it's not too hard at this point. Um, you know, I can see this uh, growing and becoming a lot. I'm not a fan of this switching the weapons. It's not, it's not um, super easy to do. Um, all right, completed all the tutorials. Let's do it. Let's start a new game. I'm excited. Drills are available for honing skills. Awesome. And you know what? Uh, we're gonna start a tutorial right after this. Stick around. More Final Fantasy 15. I mean, besides for the menu stuff, uh, combat has me intrigued. So I'm looking forward to trying it out a little more. Stay tuned. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. You know the drill. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to check out some games I've made, like Arrow Light Core. Alright, until next time, peace out!